Today is our first day that the, um, the builders and the whole crew haven't been here. And I'm not going to lie, I'm happy. It feels good. So we have a lot to do. We still have the whole trash heap, but that's still don't have the um, carpentry. Yeah. yeah, all of that, the cabinets and the drawers and blah, blah, blah. So that's next, but at least we get a break today. Mm -hmm. and, um, we can try to make it a little bit more homely. Yeah. Building in Mexico is not for the weak of heart. I swear to you, it's not. You're gonna have highs and lows, and uh, and, e and even though we're at this point right now, I can't even say we're at a high. We're just at a high because we get some alone time to start looking at what we're doing in the house. But man. So today we have a lot of yard work. <clears throat> so TJ's over there and he wants to show everyone his fire. And we should be getting our curtains today. All right, let's go check out TJ's fire. All right, he's gonna man the fire. So this is our temporary fire pit. Uh, once we're settled, we will dig a nice, nice one in the ground we'll make, but for now it worked. So we told our builders um, just to leave all these pieces of wood so that will probably last us probably like at least three years of um, fires here so we're gonna have to figure out how we're gonna organize that so it's not looking like that but um, we have fires for days we want to bring this back to life and make it look pretty so we're gonna try to dump our water our sink water yeah on it whatever we can so we're slowly getting there um, these slats were going to have slats in here. They're working on those. They did that one the last couple days. So um, it gives you little shade, but there's still obviously big spaces there. So we're going to intertwine um, the fabric that goes up there just for shade. And all those need to be done around the house. And then let's see, we got our chairs out. We don't have our cabinetry like Tamar said, so stuff is just kind of stuffed everywhere. So these should all be cabinets under here. This will not have anything underneath. We were hope, I guess we were expecting, that's our fault for expecting half of it to be like a cement wall down the middle. So the other side could kind of be like stuff tucked away, but now we can't really keep anything under there because it's just gonna show. So that's kind of wasted space there. So we got our stove, we haven't tested that out. Well, tomorrow it is running. We haven't really cooked in it. Um, our sink is still leaking, so we're working on that. Our builders are. And right now it goes, it drains to outside, um, which does not look pretty. So we're actually saving our water anyway. Um, and then it goes out to our plants to our cactuses so we can, the one that we showed you. So, and we should be having a open shelving pantry right here. And then this is a bigger space than we expected. So we're gonna have to figure out what to do with that. Maybe the water bowl will be over there more. And then um, maybe like a little bar cart or something, that would be cute. And we got our couch, we unwrapped that yesterday. It's beautiful. It's not the softest, but it's nice. And look at that view. The ocean view, the sunset views. Yeah. So again, I mentioned before, our curtains are supposed to be coming today to be installed. So that'll be nice. Cause right now we keep the lights out at night. So we feel like we're on display, even though there's not really anybody around, but we'll have curtains on all these. Um, this one will be like a shade and then curtains in TJ's room. So this is our bedroom set from Guadalajara. It's beautiful. It's, that headboard is massive. So we still have the paper on the stands, the nightstand. So we didn't put the other one in here yet. Um, our AC, the person who's installing our ACs is supposed to be coming on Monday. So we're gonna have to move all this out of the way um, and then after that's done and then our curtains today then this room will be done well 
in our cabinetry. We're not doing a TV in our bedroom. Um, we're just gonna do maybe some artwork right there or something or decorative. This is a sink I picked out. I love it. However, this, I don't know what was put in here, but it won't open. So I'm afraid I might lose my sink and have to get another one. I'm not happy about that. And here's our mirrors also that we got from Guadalajara. They're matching for both bathrooms. The one in the guest bathroom or TJ's bathroom is bigger, it's larger. And then our builder is also working on our lights for up there. And we're gonna have, we're waiting for that as well, a wooden shelf will go in there. Um, so maybe we'll put like a decorative basket in our linen, like our towels and stuff in there. Cause something we did not think about is storage space. We really have nothing for storage. Um, we're probably gonna do something ourselves here, like a closed linen closet, like wooden. We'll have to figure out or have one built so we can have like all of our extra linen, towels, whatever we need. And then something here, help us out guys. We still have no idea what we're doing here. I need all the help I can get. And just like that, we're getting curtains. And I can, I can honestly say the house feels like a house just by adding curtains. Man, it, it's one thing to be in the house and mm -hmm. you have the couch in there and the house just, it just looked, yeah, you're inside a building, but it just looked weirdish. And then as soon as they install the curtains, man. It was night and day, no. literally. Yeah. TJ and I slept in the house three nights now, tomorrow too. So the first two nights I slept with TJ in his room, Tamar slept the first night for him in our bed with the mattress plastic on. So last night Tamar and I slept in our bed and then TJ slept in his bed. And then we didn't have curtains, but we, you know, you keep like the outdoor lights on and stuff. I could not relax, like sh whatever. So I felt like I was just, you know, somebody like is looking in our windows, they could just see us, they're sleeping. So I got up in the middle of the night went in TJ's room because it was a little darker and slept there and left tomorrow. <laughs> so tonight, it will feel so much better because all of our windows are covered. We don't have to, just for peace of mind, I don't know. You don't feel like you're on this flight. Even though we're out here by ourselves, I still felt uncomfortable, so. So you can see the mountain of trash behind us over there. Yeah, that's uh, hopefully that'll be gone. Um, not tomorrow. They say tomorrow, but it's not gonna hopefully go tomorrow. Hopefully, in a few days. Yeah. Tomorrow's been hard at work organizing it all. Y'all, this pile's almost gone. Now we have one up front too. We're gonna try to get it's less that the our builders have to take to the dump so we can reuse it. Look at this beautiful pile. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below.